All right, what's going on all my new current and future rides for drivers and passengers out there? Welcome to the channel. Before I get started, if this is your first time here and you find the content helpful, entertaining, or otherwise, don't be shy, don't hesitate, smash that subscribe button, and click that little bell icon. That way you'll get notified when I come out with new videos. If you want to sign up to become an Uber driver and get a bonus guarantee automatically applied, sign up with the link in the description below. If you're an Uber driver and somehow you failed to do that before you started driving because you didn't know anybody, so you didn't use anybody's code, you may still be in luck. Follow those instructions in the description below and potentially get one retroactively applied today. Now, what I'm talking about today is this little feature. Has anybody seen this feature that was sent to me? Um, I have yet to see it, but it looked like it was pretty interesting. And it kind of made me wonder if, hmm, would this actually encourage riders to maybe tip more? Now, I know what everyone's going to say, obviously. Those that are going to tip are going to tip, and those that aren't just aren't. No matter what you do, you could give them five-star service, snacks, drinks, happy endings, all the whole the whole nine yards, right? And they still won't tip you. But I do kind of believe that maybe this little feature might let passengers know that we are actually being tipped, okay? It says, send riders thanks after they actually tip you. So... In a way, to me, I think this might let passengers know that we are, yes, receiving the tips and that obviously they are appreciated because they are, right? Almost everybody's tip sign, any drivers that have one, they say tips are greatly appreciated. I mean, hell, let's face it, guys. Most of the money that we're always hoping to extra to make is from the tips, all right? I mean, some markets have the extra rider bonuses and everything else, but not everybody has it. So anything at all that can help us make more money, I definitely smash that thumbs up button. I'm all for anything that actually helps drivers. But now in the same of saying this, why was this just now thought of to implement? This should have been put in when we started tipping, right? But you see it right there. Then you can say thanks. Thanks sent. So that way they know that we actually got the money. But sadly i mean they have to rate us before they even tip us so that can kind of get to be like nerve-wracking now and then what's going on ben what's going on daniel savage jc said can we customize that no as far as i know you can't orlando what's going on man what did i miss all you missed is supposedly i don't know if this is in every market yet or they're just testing it out but you can send your riders thanks after they tip you all right so all you have to do is click it and actually send thanks afterwards of course this obviously means that you have to get tipped to even say thank you but the simple fact of it being there it can't hurt right that can't hurt at all and anything this was on an update yes um a driver from philly actually sent this to me yesterday he updated his app yesterday and that's where it was if you have this in your market, let me know. Let's get some 111s one, one, ones. if you have it in your market. 555 five, five if you have not got it yet. ABQ, hey, what's going on, man? He got the little poop emoji. <laughs> thank you for that dollar, bro. I appreciate that. Let me let me hit the thank you button. Click. Thank you, sent. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. So 555s, five, five, five. lots of fives. They do not have it yet. Ronnie has it in his market. It's not in San Diego. We have it here in L.A. Oh, okay. That's what's up. So hopefully you L.A. drivers have been making a lot more money. Let's see. They'd probably rather have the writers give us kudos than pay us more. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that at all. Ariel says, I have it in Florida. Well, that's good. I didn't know it was in Florida. Lyft is now letting drivers know where the passengers are going here in Texas. Oh, that's interesting. Is that with Uber Pro, though? I assume that's with Uber Pro. Haven't seen it in Vegas yet. Haven't been on this week, Miss Thorpe says. But that's what's up. But what do you guys think? You think this is this is actually going to be helpful? I think this is helpful. I mean, could there have been a lot of other things they could have done to make it so passengers tip more or remind them to tip? Sure. Could they do other things to make drivers happy? You know, like give us back 80, 20 or anything else? Sure. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of things they could do. But they haven't yet. So in the meantime, in saying that, since they haven't yet, I still think this is this is pretty neat, at least to me, that um, I would definitely use it. Every time I got tipped, I would definitely smash that. All right. Now, as far as I know, you cannot customize it or anything else. 
It just says send Ryder thanks. So who knows what that little thank you line actually says? I don't know. Does it appear after they enter a tip or, or before? Um, after. That's how you do it is after. <coughs> ABQ says I'd rather send a poop emoji to one star riders. I heard that. I heard that, bro. Please tell me why people still sit 100 deep at the airport. I, <laughs> some people don't know how to work their markets, guys. If you don't know how to work your markets, you try to do the, the easiest, laziest thing possible, and that's sit and wait at some place you know you're guaranteed to ride eventually. You're right, Dustin. Uber should have done this a long time ago. They should have done this as soon as it was implemented. As soon as tips were implemented that we could actually receive them in the app, they should have had these features. What they should do is make the rating along with the tip option automatically come up as the ride ends and the next time they open the app. I agree with that, Mark. I like that right there. If they did not tip or rate their driver, it makes them automatically do that the next time. That would be nice. A lot more drivers would actually get ratings and probably get tips. Hey, what's going on, Bill? What's going on, Bill from Florida? <laughs> what's the new feature? The new feature is, I guess, after you get a tip, you receive a tip, you will have a notice that pops up saying, send rider thanks. So you can click that, send them thanks, and then that's all it says afterwards is thanks sent. That's all it'll say afterwards. So to me, I mean, just the fact that passengers know you received the tip in it, it kind of helps make sure we received the tip, right? I mean, we all know uh, a lot of people have been claiming not to be getting tips and seeing passengers put the tips in and not get it. At least this is help for extra verification. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I'm pretty sure this would also be for Uber Eats. So those people not doing, uh, you know, driving around with normal Uber and just doing food deliveries, this might also be in there for you guys as well. So you could tell them thanks. Because I know a lot of drivers, especially for Uber Eats, they would sit there and text the passengers after they picked up the food and have like some little, you know, pre-message thing that you've already put together. And it was like, I'm on my way. I'll be there in so-and-so minutes. Um, you know what I mean? Don't forget to tip your driver. <laughs> you know, I've seen drivers do lots of different things. So this would be nice, though. I think it's an extra little feature. Now, is it, you know, like, woo, woo, hoo, hoo, like, throw a party. Is it like that cool? No, it's not. Okay. But I do think that this is still a step in a good direction. This is an actual, uh, what do they call them? Oh, uh, man. Not a change. Uh, I forgot the word for it. But this is actually something I'd like instead of the other crap. You know what I'm saying? Wish passengers had a public star rating for how often they tip their drivers. <laughs> That's what's up. You're the best man. I enjoy your channel. Thank you, Theron. I appreciate that, man. Tips are always appreciated. <laughs> but if they're going to tip you in the app, which, you know, we all hate. Oh, improvement. That's the word I'm looking for. Improvements. You know, out of all the improvements they give us all the times, at least this is something I actually would like and I would definitely use. Every time I got tipped, I would make sure I would tell them people, thank you. Obviously. Keep encouraging the, the passengers to tip their drivers. If you would tip your waiter, if you would tip the doorman, taxi drivers, you know, pizza guys, you should tip your damn Uber driver. All right, we get you from point A to point B, and some drivers provide extra. Some drivers provide snacks and drinks and entertainment. You know what I mean? They got little gaming systems in there, like Dark Road Run. He's got the whole nine yards. You can sit there and play any game you want. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? ABQ, don't be cheap, guys. Send the man a super chat. <laughs> I appreciate that, ABQ. Let the super chats fly. Super Chat Wars 99. But yeah, guys, I want, like I said, once again, this isn't like the best feature out there, but at least it's something. And we all know something is always better than nothing. Like even if you only got tipped $1, that's still $1 more than you had. All right. Obviously, I mean, you're going to get taxed on that $1 if they do it through the app. Hence why we all say cash is king, baby. 
You tip in cash, you ain't got to worry about it because I can say thank you in person. You know what I'm saying? I'll tip you on the super chat. <laughs> All right, Ace. I'll be expecting that soon. <laughs> I charge my passengers for traction control. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. I'll be seeing drivers out there charging them for AC, for heat. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, you want to roll my window down? That's a 50 cent charge. And it's a 50 cent every quarter. It's like 50, 75. <laughs> but if you agree that this is at least, this isn't the greatest thing out there, but it is a good improvement, I would think. Make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Go, we got one guy, thumbs up. Man. Yet another minor way of dehumanizing communication like with Uber comfort and temperature. Let's be big boys and use our words. Great live, live chat as usual, though. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. And yeah, I, I do agree with you that it is uh, it's something else to take the human out of it when obviously they, they should make it tip us. As soon as they rate us, it should automatically, it should be right there. And then I agree with what someone said that as soon as a rider opens up their app again to order another ride, it should automatically make them have to rate us. If we have to rate every passenger, every passenger should have to rate every driver. That's how I feel. You know what I'm saying? And that would make things a lot, you know, fairer for both. But if we have to rate a passenger after each and every ride, passengers need to rate us after each and every ride. What's going on, Tony? I just got here. I missed it. You know what, Tony? Just for you, we'll go ahead and do a quick recap because it's not that big of a thing. But supposedly now in some markets, they're letting you send thanks to your rider after they tip you. So this way, it's a verification in a way that you got a tip and that your passengers know you received the tip and are actually appreciative of it. And then as you can see afterwards, that's what it looks like. It says, thanks, sent. That's it. Just something simple. But I like to think that this could possibly lead to passengers tipping more. That's what I would like to think. I mean, you know, doesn't mean I'm right. But it can't hurt. That's why I even tell drivers out there, after each and every ride, if you can, use my simple, you know, cliche of a line or whatever. Say, so, hey, you know, whatever your conversation's been going down, be like, hey, you've been a five-star passenger. Stay safe and have a great day or night. You know what I'm saying? Just something like that. And that just kind of puts in their mind, oh, five stars. Reminds them to rate you. And then when they rate you, obviously, they can see the option to tip you. So it can't hurt your chances. You know what I mean? And you can make a joke out of it however you want to do it. But my line, I have gotten feedback from plenty of drivers out there that have used it. Say it works great. All right. And who doesn't like to see that extra tip? Especially look at that. $30 tip. $30 tip. Who does not like a $30 tip? If you don't like a $30 tip, you want one hell of a trip. <laughs> I'm telling you. Passengers that won't tip won't tip just because the society as a whole has changed from 20 years ago. Unfortunately, today's society does not tip. That's the way the world is. In a lot of places, that is true, Rideshare PA. That is true. And that's why I say that those who will tip will and those who won't won't. Mike said, don't take Walmart rides at the beginning or at the middle of the month. And we all know why, because that is military payday. <laughs> What is going on, everybody? What's going on, Donnie? Come on, Jeff, man. They can rate my nuggets. <laughs> no cry, baby. What's going on, man? If you guys have not yet, check out Rideshare PA's channel and No Cry Baby Rideshare's channel, guys. Make sure you go over there. Send them some love. Tip them in the app, guys. See? Make sure you send some thanks to them. Send some thanks along their way. All right? So, again, if you guys have this, let me know if you don't. Hopefully it does come to all markets because this would actually be great. Dustin, you think our Eagles can still take the NFC East? You're damn right they can. Fly, Eagles, fly, baby. You know it. You know it. I love to pick up servers, bartenders, because I make them tip me. To me, service, bartenders, bellhops, everybody that gets tips for a living actually tips more than the people that don't. That's just my opinion. All right. But again, guys, if you have this in your market, let me know in the description below. Um, if you'd like to see it come, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Guys, use the damn gas app. Check the description below for extra information and tips. The gas app is there, guys, okay? 
Gas is on the rise. You need to save money. It's getting time for Christmas soon, okay? Get the gas app. Download it. Share it. Use it. It's simple. It's easy to use. I have videos on how to use it, how you can get money back from it, and you can make money off of it each and every single day. But all right, guys, as always, do your thing. Get your money. Don't take crap from anybody, but please use common sense. The gas app is the Get Upside gas app. It's in the description below, Seth. I also have the video on how it's used. It's real simple, guys. That'll help you make some extra money, save some extra money. It's a win-win scenario. And who doesn't like that? It's just like being able to get tipped in the app. <laughs> Thank you all. You guys all be great. Stay safe. And until next time, guys, Uber on or don't. But get those tips. Peace out.